Hi guys, as promised, today we'll be installing our new faucet from China. Up where it is. Here we go. This one. But to do that, first we need to disassemble the old one. And for that purpose, it's quite useful to get these extended long sockets because as you probably know, the mounting is usually this metal semicircular piece and then you have this long threaded pin and with a regular socket you wouldn't reach to the nut. And with a key like this, you'll be moving it around like 50,000 times. Quite a tedious job with this. It'll be quite quick and easy. Okay. Unlike a real plumber, I'll pull my pants up. No butt crack shots today. I won't give you that satisfaction. So to make things easier, instead of one screw, we have two in the case on this faucet. So double the work. Okay, one screw and done. And now for the second one. Okay. So as you can see, this is this semicircular piece and one of the pins. As you can see, the nut didn't want to come out the end, so the whole thing unscrewed. Okay. Unscrew the tubes. Okay. And now we have the old faucet removed. We got some rust collected here. Okay. In this case, just hand tightening should be sufficient. These two O-rings, they should provide sufficient water tightness. Make sure you install this O-ring here, which provides even matching of your basin. We've got to dive underneath again. So we'll try a different tactic, hand tighten it on the bottom, then use the whole faucet, turn it to the center, use it as a lever. Perfect. So now just for the water supply tubes, it should be working.
Okay, water open, nothing leaking. So I believe a full success. So have you ever seen an integrated faucet cover like this? I only discovered this one type of a faucet. It was part of a set. I haven't seen them available for purchase as standalone, but it works very well.